Hi, this is Ron Wade with IDT with another technical tidbit for you that's going to save you a lot of time if you ever encounter this in one of your designs. So what I have is a typical uh, clock transmission line here with the clock driver and the series resistor driving a 50 ohm transmission line. And again, all of these waveforms are drawn assuming we're measuring at the very end of the transmission line as mentioned in prior videos. So if you recall, the, uh, the output impedance plus the series resistor value should equal to 50 ohms. I'm drawing a single-ended waveform here and the important thing to note is that there's actually a pull-up impedance for this guy and a pull-down impedance and they should be identical. When they're identical you get the perfect waveform. Here I've intentionally drawn this waveform with some ringing on the, on the, on the rising edge and having the falling edge be perfectly uh, matched. What this means is that the driver itself is not matched. If you have ringing it up here, that means when the driver is pulling up, this impedance is low. Uh, this impedance plus the resistance is less than 50 ohms. Whereas when it's pulling down, the way it's drawn here, the impedance plus the resistor is exactly equal to 50 ohms. The other thing you might see is a waveform where instead of having ringing on one of the edges, you have a step on one of the edges. And if you recall from uh, earlier videos. Um, that means that the sum of the output impedance plus the resistor is greater than the 50 ohms. That means that when this waveform is pulling up, the impedance of the driver is higher than when it is pulling down. And it's higher to the point where that plus the resistor is greater than the transmission line impedance. So this could just as easily uh, be drawn or this could just as easily occur only on the falling edge or only on the falling edge here. So as long as they're both occurring identically, you can adjust it out with the resistor. But if you see only on one half of the clock, the rising edge or falling edge, that means that the driver's got a problem and you need to talk to your silicon manufacturer. That's it for today. Thanks.